good Sunday afternoon to you. And it's a beauty, beauty, beauty. Oh, so all those heat wave days we've been having. Shit. It's like mid 80s right now. Humidity is bearable. No wind, sunny. It's just perfect. Perfect. It just paralyzes me. I come out into it when it's just perfect and I'm just like, ah. Oh. evaporate into the air or something. I don't know. But I do know. I'm very fucking worn out, tired, and sore. But it's that good sore that I like from working properly and hard all week. But uh, still, it's, uh, but you gotta push through it. And uh, I'm gonna try to keep today a little different. Try to put a little more relaxation into Sundays instead of always uh, task stuff. So I'm going to try to relax a little, have a little fun, hang out with my woman, and uh, try to get some other stuff on tape later. I'm going to try to do some some knife things, some tomahawk maybe. I got this new knife here I want to do a little review with. steel mayhem. I'm going to do that. I'm going to cut some uh, bottles and stuff. Hopefully, just have a good day. I'm going to try to put too much on my plate. I'm going to try to overdo myself. Did good this week. I got to go slow. Take it easy for a day. Still do little stuff, but you know, I'm not crazy. But I have to get back on top of the journal, log entries more regularly than what I've been doing. So I'm going to cut off now. I got a, I got an ice cream mission. I got to run. I mean, my trusty scooter. I'm going to get a thing of ice cream and come back. And then uh, I'll record some more later. Yes, three, two, one, and close out. Closing out what I said. I was going to do earlier with the earlier the first recording that was on this you just saw before this and to be honest with you I don't want to do it right now on the wall not because of anything like anger towards it or anything and I want to do it but physically I'm just tired and I'm shot and uh Worn out, and basically, would just rather be sitting and watch the TV in the air conditioning. But I will be. I'll have time. It's time for both. So I definitely have to get done. I could. I said then. So then I can sleep uh, better, or even before sleep, my time up in the box. Will we not be one of uh, like loathing it? Uh, why did you do that today? Why you should have did that? Yeah, you fucking waste. Of time. I hate that. It will be it'll be one of like, yeah. I did it. I did it. Now I can move up and get the next peg tomorrow. The part of them is uh. We get going back to doing the uh, videos again like. More often than once a week, once every other week. But hey, what the hell? You know, it is a uh, unpredictable channel. I am unpredictable by nature. Therefore, my one, my channel is to be an extension of me. You know. Let's see if uh, anyone knows this one from the movie. This great one. And I, I apply it to myself. I don't want my environment, no, I don't want to be a product of my environment. I want my environment to be a product of me. Give me just a few seconds. Jack Nicholson departed. Leonardo DiCaprio. I haven't seen it. Run. 
don't walk, run to see it. All right, wrap up uh, the journal entry recently. Uh, it is Sunday night. Time of day is uh, still kind of early, 22, 40 hours. Uh, temperatures perfect, actually. Hesitant to use that word with weather, but it actually is today. It's a high, I think, age five. Oh, clear, nice skies, not angry winds. You know, about, you know, my, my little machine. Oh, I love riding this thing, it's so fun. I gotta get a helmet though. Because I do exceed speeds of 30 and even 35 miles an hour on that little sucker. Believe it or not. I have some stuff I pulled out. I was going to read. I was going to do shorts. Uh, I did. I did one. That's it. I usually do three at a time, but I'm not doing that right now. I just don't have the time. But I did one. And then I have a couple of these other ones that are too long for the minute shorts. So maybe I'll think of reading one of them on here. But that's kind of weird. Journal? No, it's not a journal entry. That's just what my name uh, Sometimes I say things that are so. I don't even know how to put it so wrong, so like mathematically uh, all kinds of ways wrong that even myself I say it. What am I talking about? You know, it doesn't happen that often, but you know, it happens sometimes. So, and now as I'm standing here, I don't want to be one of them. make myself do it because I really don't want to do it. That's kind of one of the, my little things I do all day throughout your life when I write down. All right, you know this one. This was the first one that I originally picked anyway. Uh, to read. Right. Again, put the microphone in. this anyway because I did six minutes anyway so I'm gonna read this anyway however it sounds and then maybe I'll read it over again with the microphone. We should tie this to that thing with like a, a fluorescent green or yellow zip tie. Not a bad fucking idea. Perfect. I also write one liners too and multi-pagers and all different side things but this there's two here one is the long one and then top i have a one liner let's see up here it's perfect for what i was just talking about my brain is a 24-hour fast food library warehouse video laundromat sometime all right here we go get this over with get this done quick and then stop I don't want to hear about their little trials and tribulations, about their fucking car problems or fucking job they hate. They'd rather complain than have the guts it takes to leave and enter the real world and sail the seas of consequence. What the hell do they expect? How can they complain about being bored and unsatisfied with life? When they surround themselves with mediocrity, and complacency and a lifestyle that grinds them down and slowly drains them of their will to live. 
Why not be an outsider? Why not go about the whole thing differently? Too many people get caught up in the idea of how things should be, from how their family does or did things, how their neighbors or peers do things, or how they have always done things, or what TV, magazines, or social media and the internet tells them. They listen and follow everything and anything that comes from an external source. Rather than listening to the one and only voice that matters, their own voice. What's even worse is people, most people, let others formulate their lifestyles and ideas of right and wrong, good or bad, for them. From the toxins they take that poison them, to the jobs they hate, to the unhappy marriages they won't leave, to the kids they can't be bothered with, to the culture that bores and dumbs them down, to the media that lies and misleads them. Well, they can have it all. They can have my helping too. So basically the bottom line of this whole piece of writing is this. I'd rather go on my own ideas and fail horribly than to go their way and make it. And with that, my friends, I'm going to conclude. I would have talked longer, but now that I realize I didn't put the microphone in and the whole thing might be shot anyway, the message at this time thank you new subscribers thank you old subscribers I really appreciate it I really do